Hi there. Hi. <laughs> Where have you been? Oh, I've been uh, getting our uh, resources together to invest in the harbor project. I also, uh, that looks good. Mm -hmm. I also had a chance to uh, check in with Reva and oh. uh, ask her how she feels about checking into a clinic. Oh, well, I tried talking to her myself, but didn't have much success. Really? Yeah. yeah. Well, I think I convinced her that it would be for the best. Really? Mm. Yeah, she admitted that some of the things she's been saying sound pretty crazy, even to her. I can't believe that. I mean, that's, it's good. It's good because she'll get the help that she needs. And it's not like she has to stay away a long time, right? Well, I suppose that would depend on what her doctors say. Well, Shane can stay with us if he wants to, and, and the kids can go visit her whenever they want. She doesn't have to be alone through all this. You know, that's very generous of you. This is going to work out for the best, Josh. It will, I promise you. You know what? Investing in the Harbor Project was a brilliant idea. And thanks to your excellent instincts, we are going to be rich <laughs> and successful beyond our wildest dreams. I can't believe you're finally coming around. I can't believe I ever doubted you in the first place. You really are something else. Well, uh, assuming Reva's flight left on time, I, I guess she's on her way to the clinic right about now. I, I can't believe she agreed to go, especially on her own. Well, I didn't offer to take her, and she didn't ask. I think she really understands now that this is, uh, it's over, you know, this codependency we've had, whatever you want to call it, it's, it's done. And she's on her own now. Wow, boy, you know, I really didn't mean to make that sound so cold. It's not that I want to turn my back on Reva. I just, no, I just want to... No, you just want to maintain a, a healthy balance, you know, maybe yeah. give other aspects of your life their proper due. Yeah. Like you. She's always been between us, Josh, whether you knew it or not. Well, that's done. It's over. Whole new chapter now we're writing. Right now, I want to focus on other things on our marriage and on the business. Making the Harbor Project a huge success. Yeah, well, that's just the first step. Really? Mm, yeah, <laughs> really. Well, hey, look, you've been talking to me about taking more risks, right? Uh -huh. Smart risks. Well, I've, I've heard what you've been saying, and so is Billy. What does that mean? Well, we're working on a little something on the side. In fact, Billy's on the horn right now. He's trying to make it happen. You're going to tell me about it, right? No, ma'am. No, I'm not going to tell you about it. I'll, I'll tell you what, I'll give you a hint, though, okay? If, if this deal works out how I expect, everyone involved in the Harbor Project will get exactly what they deserve. And then some. The same page, then. Same sentence, same word. You guarantee you'll step in before any corporate secrets can be compromised. Just tell us one. Okay. Josh? Hi, you left the door open. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is Dan Meyer. He lives down the block. Uh, Hello. This is my wife, Olivia Lewis. Uh, Dan just stopped in because he'd heard about Reva. He wanted to know if there's anything he could do, and I appreciate that. I really do. Uh, as I said to you before, I'll keep you posted. Please do. Okay. Thank nice you. meeting you, Miss Lewis. Me too. <laughs> you, uh... Oh, I, I know the way. Out. Yes, okay. <sighs> so, what are you doing here? No, oh, you didn't think you can get me hot and bothered and then run out on me, do you? Hot and bothered? Yeah, you know business is a big turn-on for me, and the prospect of Lewis going public, that is a mega, now, mega turn-on. Just a minute, just a minute now. You did not hear that from my lips. Speaking of lips, you know what's sexy? It's when you have a secret. You know what's even sexier? Getting it out of you. Mm. <laughs> No, what? no, I can't, I can't do this. Why? What's wrong? This is... This is wrong, I'm sorry. Don't, don't you want to be with me? Yes, yes, of course I want to be with you, just not here. This, this is Reva's house. Oh, oh, okay, I just figured, you know, she's not 
She's away and she's not going to walk in the door or anything like that. Yeah. Uh, and this, you know, this is your house too, sort of. Yes, but, you know, my son still lives here. All right, all right. Uh, maybe it's a little naughty, but is now it makes it fun? Uh, Besides, I can't help myself. I mean, I, ever since you decided to support me and put all your money into this project, it's just made me want you all the more. Trust is a very sexy thing. Uh, someone's here. Mm. Somebody's here. <laughs> uh, hi. Hi. Hey. Hey. Hi. What are you guys doing here? Uh, um, your mom asked me to, uh, your mom asked me to stop by and check up on you, on both of you, I guess. Huh? Dad, I live hmm. in a dorm, remember? I don't exactly need checking up on. And Shane's not really teething either, so what's going on? Yeah, something wrong? Where's mom? Uh, she, she had to go away. What? For how long? I don't know. <laughs> You see, your mother, she's, uh, she's with people who can uh, help her to uh, sort some things out. Where? It's, it's just a place that, that specializes in mental health. It, it, it's, a, it's a clinic, son. Uh, in, in fact, she checked herself in. This was uh, her decision. And you know what? Once she's out, I hope we can just work all this out. Oh, I wish we could have talked to Mom before she left. It, it's not like her not to leave a note or something. Yeah, but... You have to understand, she wasn't in any kind of shape to do something like that. But she did want me to pass on to you both how much she loves you, okay? Can't we talk to her or go see her? No, actually. Uh, but she won't be gone for a very long time. Uh, she'll be back soon. <laughs> hey. Okay. Why don't I go into the kitchen and whip up some dinner? No, I have a better idea. Why don't we, why don't we all just go out someplace? How would that be? Hmm? How about sure. company? Company. Yeah, whatever. There you go. <laughs> well, why don't the three of you go on out and uh, I'll, I'll turn off the lights and lock the place up. I'll, sure. I'll be out in just a minute. Okay, go ahead. I'll be right out, I promise. <clears throat> Our world is rarely simple, and we face so many challenges every day. But we rally together. We take strength from each other, knowing we will get through, we will persevere, and we desperately miss those who can't be with us.